Hello, welcome to Ludic Science. Today I will show you this little experiment, a magnetic accelerator. This is a very crude representation of the machines that are used in elementary particle physics research, where they accelerate elementary particles such as protons to make them collide at very high speeds and study the physics of the collisions. In our case, we are using an electromagnet to accelerate our particle, which is simply a steel ball. Every time the ball passes near the magnet, this is activated and pushes the ball. In every revolution, the steel ball receives a push from the electromagnet and makes it rotate around. Next time you need a PCB for your electronics project, consider using the professional services of JLC PCB. JLC PCB is the world leader in PCB fabrication. You can order online. You just need to register, upload your Gerber file, and wait a few days for your PCBs at an unbeatable price. The rail where the steel ball runs is made of plastic, it is 3D printed and we have the coil, it is made of 30 gauge magnet wire, it has approximately 1000 turns, it is not a critical parameter and we also have this device which is used to detect the position of the steel ball and turn on the coil at the point where the ball is entering the center of the coil. The way in which this device works, it is a proximity sensor, inductive proximity sensor, is explained in another of my videos. The link is in the description. And now let's see the circuit. We also need to add a transistor and a resistor to the circuit. Here we have the schematic. This is our coil. And here we have the inductive sensor. It has three wires, blue, black, and brown. Every time the steel ball passes near the sensor, a signal is sent to the black wire that goes to the transistor's base and the transistor is turned on. Then the current can flow through the coil and accelerates the steel ball. Once the ball is away from the sensor, the signal disappears and the coil turns off. Ok, let's see it working. I'm going to put the steel ball You can see how the sensor turns on every time the ball passes near. I am using a 2N3055 transistor, but the circuit works with any NPN power transistor. The resistor 
68 to 100 ohms and must have a power of 1 watt or more. Okay, that's all for today. A very simple magnetic accelerator. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for your visit and see you in the next one.